ancient seeds, so obviously we're going to get that done. Uh, so let's do that over here. Actually, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Quality fertilizer improves the soil quality, increases your chance. We have five quality fertilizer, ten ancient seeds. We, we could still put the fertilizer down after planting them. We just can't do it once they started growing, right? So I kind of want to get more quality. For, isn't that that's the one that requires the fish, right? Like in the recipe? Yeah, yeah, yeah. One, uh, two sap and any type of fish. So that's why I've been keeping like mussels and all that kind of stuff randomly, right? So kind of want to get that. And then we'll be able to get like gold star, iridium star angel. Oh, yeah, wait, hold on. Don't we have a thing? No, that was foraging, wasn't it? Yeah, forage items are always the highest quality. Yeah. Farming is, yeah, they're worth 40% more when they're uh, in the artisan goods thing. Yeah. Okay, I had that. I was just making sure there in case, like, we're always going to get a iridium quality crop, but it only works on forage things, which I, we haven't even tried that out yet. So, definitely want to try that out sometime, right? But for right now, ancient seeds, boom. We're going to have two rows of ancient seeds, I believe, right? Because we have 10 seeds, boom. There it is. Amazing. We'll uh, definitely have to do this. We're going to have to manually water this first one here because they only water at the start of the day, right? So, there you go. And we'll water these here, too. There you go. So, we have ancient seeds up here on the top left. How many, uh, we have 14 rare seeds, so we'll be able to do two and, uh, almost, almost three rows. Actually, yeah, two, straight up two rows, because one row there, and then the sprinkle takes up, so, hold on, yeah, let's do the rare seeds next. And, uh, so that means 14, just the rare seeds like this. Come on, one, two, just making sure. And that, that, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, it looks like the sprinklers are able to water all these here. This is amazing, guys, holy heck. This is insane. This is absolutely insane. We have a greenhouse now, you guys. And it's raining outside, so yeah, these things aren't going to be able to benefit from the rain. They're kind of sheltered in here. And by the way, hold on, hold on. Is that... Is that a thing? It is! Okay, so that's how it could actually... Ref that's actually really good. Although I'm probably not going to need it because I have the, the sprinklers in here, right? But yeah, that, that's really good. I could refill my watering can from the greenhouse. Now, we need 14 plus 5. We need 19 quality fertilizer. Don't know if we have 19 just fish just laying around. But remember, we have that fish chest, so we probably have a bunch of uh, just random fish that I'm honestly never going to use. And honestly, yeah, yeah, speaking of such, maybe we should start selling some of the fish inside there to Willy. Get some of the money back. When I some of the ores finished up right there, cool. Uh, then that's going to be a way of getting money, as well as, you know, selling a bunch of coffee. And then that's going to be a way of us getting money for the pigs and the, and the original sprinklers and stuff. Yeah, but definitely want to get the original. Actually, you know what? We don't even need the, uh, because we can craft like two or three of them right now. We have iridium uh, things, but if we can buy it, yeah, I definitely want to do that. So uh, yeah, sell the poppy honey. Don't want to forget about that. Let's put these up inside of, uh, whoops. Yeah, that's the wrong, uh, because I'm putting them inside the fridge now. Let's grab some fish that we're going to be using. So I, I, how, how much do I get from this bowl head? 187, meh, meh, you know? Crab. What are the recipes for that? Sashimi, quality fertilizer, yeah. I don't know if I'm going to make crab cakes or maki rolls or sashimi. So I think I'm going to use the crab for, and by the way, there, there's the muscle right there. The clam, does the clam work for the, uh, it does not. It does not work. It doesn't count as a fish, I guess. So that kind of sucks. Uh, you can make a water obelisk out of it. With clam chowder. Or speed. Okay, we'll use it for speed grow. So yeah, I guess I'll keep it. Uh, but let me keep looking around. Yeah, see like red snapper, I assume. Yeah, yeah. We can use that for quality fertilizer. So let me grab 19 fish worth of uh, fish. <laughs> and then hopefully we'll be able to actually, especially like no star uh, things like, like this bullhead right here. Then we'll be able to use, uh, we'll be able to make some quality. And by the way, hold on. Don't I have quality fertilizer somewhere? Oh, I thought we did. I guess not. And by the way, yeah, we have pumpkin. I need to put that in the right chest. Starfruit seeds. Why do I have that? Why is that in here? I'm getting comments about that, uh, that I never used that. So I guess, I don't know. Maybe we could, yeah, we should probably plant those in the, that up there. That, that probably makes sense. The greenhouse, right? So I, I guess I'll use that. Maybe we could put it on the top right corner. We could start putting starfruit or something with that. I don't know. Uh, and that, didn't you guys say I could put trees in there too? And by the way, can I upgrade the greenhouse? Like, can Robin do that? Because I don't think that was ever an option before, but I guess because it was dilapidated, but I wonder if we talked to her now. She has an option to upgrade the greenhouse. I'm curious about that now. God, there's so many things going on right now, you guys. The game is opening up, and we're, we're going to be able to we're able to do a lot of things. Holy heck. <laughs> you can tell I'm excited about the game right now, huh? Okay, so let's grab the sap. We need that. We need, like, two sap for every fish. So, uh, yeah, we need about, like, what, 38 sap? So, I don't know. I, I guess I'll just manually grab that so it doesn't take it up. Extra inventory space, whatever I'm done. There you go. Uh, let's put the pumpkin seeds back up inside of there. Oh, yeah, we had a uh, basic fertilizer. That's what we had, I guess. I guess we didn't have a bunch of quality fertilizer just laying around. Huh? So that kind of sucks. Uh, but yeah, let's, let's get another espresso. Do I have another espresso in here? Yeah, I, I have 38 of it. Yeah, because I was going to sell that on purpose. And by the way, yeah, um, let's, let's go grab that poppy honey or whatever that was. Hold on. Did I sell that? Okay, it's still there. Okay, cool. And by the way, by the way, by the way, by the way, mayonnaise, all that kind of stuff. Are those done? 
Wait, I, oh my gosh, I never even checked up. I'm probably getting comments saying, oh, you have the auto grabber thing and you never even heckin' used it. So <laughs> yeah, let's get those going. Golly, I'm glad I came over here to double check. And we have duck eggs today too, so I would have missed out on a lot of money, you guys. There you go, cool. They already have plenty of uh, food inside here. I might want to grab some of the from the some of the hay that's just kind of uh, laying around. And by the way, okay, yeah, there you go. Wait, what? Why are there? Which which cow did I not milk? How do you tell which cow you haven't milked just by looking at them? Ah, is there even a way to see? I don't know. Oh, I I guess it was that one. Okay. Uh, there you go. Hold on. One 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 ten right now. Are we going to get the money to do this? Cause what? Whoa, man, Marnie closes at five. I want to say right. Hold on. She's like right here, yeah. No, four. And then we have the traveling. God, man. Everyone's like suctioning the money out of me right now, you guys. Man. Uh, I'm trying to like think of like what what do I what do I do? Let, let me let me keep grabbing fish for the quality fertilizer. Hold on. Yeah, let me let me keep doing that. Shad, yeah, get rid of that garbage. I don't need that. Uh the crabs, I guess I'll use that. Chubs, yeah, we have a lot of those. Yeah, yeah, random random things that we caught whenever we're trying to catch something else. Yeah, I'll grab those, right? Especially if they're like silver star, or no star, or whatever. Okay, I just grabbed a bunch of random fish right there. We do have an uh, Iridium Bullhead. I don't know how much money we're going to get out of that. 187, eh, a little, little bit of money right there, but... Uh, probably not going to be selling the fish to make money, to be quite honest. Let's keep making a quality for it. Is there any, uh, there's Speed Grother Deluxe Speed... Ooh. I probably should have been keeping the coral, honestly. Stimulates leaf production. Guaranteed to increase growth rate by at least 25% and mix into till soil. Ooh. Yeah, you know what? Let's just keep making quality... I can make... Oh my gosh, I can make all of them right now. What? I have 29 fish in here? What? How many fish... Where, where are they? I didn't grab that many, did I? Uh, I guess I did. Okay. Well, oh yeah, some of these have two, some of them have three. All right, well, yeah, let's, let's make all 19 uh, quality fertilizer. Lip, 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 lip. There you go. And uh, some of them didn't even, I didn't even grab the mussels or the crabs or anything like that, so it's kind of surprising right there. Let's put the fish back, I suppose. And uh, lip, 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 lip. There you go. Cool. And uh, now we have the quality fertilizer. And by the way, I probably should have got another one because we have the star fruit now. Man, we, we, we could plant that tomorrow. Let's plant that tomorrow. How long does it take? 13 days? Yeah, maybe go to the desert, buy more of those. Oh my gosh, some of the, uh, some of the pickled, whatever, what is that? Pickled cauliflower, nice. How much, how much do we get from that? We're getting a lot of money now, you guys. That's about four grand. That's actually not bad. That's not bad. We, we do need the money. And by the way, anything good in here? Uh, uh just calm mushrooms. I'll still grab them, though. Let's grab all of those. There we go. Cool. Let's go back to the greenhouse. And, uh, you know what? The greenhouse might actually be a nice, nice place to put that, like, obsidian obelisk or whatever the thing's called, right? What's that thing called? We're able to teleport like across because I assume you could put inside of here and then maybe another one inside the, the farmhouse and we'd be able to teleport over the greenhouse instead. Yeah, this. Wait, which, where is it? This thing right here. Mini. Uh, this thing. Yeah, I could actually make that like right now. I, I assume I need two of them. So that, that means, you know, there are 60 hardwood, 40 total essence and then six gold bars. I assume making this doesn't give you two of them. So I assume you have to make them each like one at a time. So uh, that kind of sucks. But. Let's get the quality fertilizer on all these because you can't put fertilizer on them whenever uh, they've already started growing. There you go. Wait, how many? Uh, did I miss one? To this one right here, and that one right there. There you go. I was about to say like, did I like forget how to do math for a second? <laughs> and I got too many of them or something like that. But yeah, so we have all those planted down, which is really good. And I kind of want to keep those separate so I know which one's which. Uh, so we have the ancient fruit on the top left and the rare seeds on the bottom left or top bottom. Yeah, bottom left. I don't know what I was talking about. Uh, it's like second guessing myself. I know. So put the the, the fertilizer back. Or uh, man, I'm all over the place. Cauliflower back over there. There you go. Do I want to get more? Because we got a bunch of coffee, anyways, right? Two thirty right now. Um, we need we need money for the pigs. We could buy it with sixteen grand to get the pig right now. Um, I feel like if I got the coffee beans, that is. Yeah, you know what? Yeah, let me grab the beans right now, and then we can, I can get the coffee later today. You know, it doesn't matter what time. By the way, how much money do we get from that? If I just, if I, if I just sold that, fifteen grand. So if I if I bought the iridium sprinkler of the pigs, we'd be that that's twenty six grand right there. We could probably get the shed started today, you guys. Maybe. Hmm. Let, let, let's. I, I know I'm going to get comments talking about the coffee and all the kind of stuff, but I'm like the melons are going right now. The coffee is it's going it's going to. By the way, by the way, by the by the heckin' way. So much time is passing right now. I, Let's just get on the horse. I'm, I'm trying to move as fast as possible. Oak resin right there. Forget about that trash. Um, I might going to be able to go to them. I I think I can. Like I'm thinking in my head. Like, am I able to go like all around places I want to go? Go to Pierre, sell in the trash, empty his heckin' bank account. Poppy honey, boom, thirty one hundred ninety two. Just get that money right there, boom. Pickle cauliflower, thirty nine hundred twenty, boom. We're up to thirty one thousand. Thirty three thousand, yep. 
And then we're going to sell almost all the triple shot espresso. All except for, say, I'd say five or ten. So we're going to get some great, amazing money on that. Yeah, let's just keep five in our inventory because we have regular coffee at home and even more coffee beans, which we can't even do anything with right now. We're at 47,000. So if I spend 26,000 on the pig and the iridium sprinkler, we're going to be down to 20, 21. That's 21,000. There's that number again, 21. We need 15,000 to get the uh, shed. I think we're good right now. I don't think we need to buy it unless there's something else that I just can't remember right now, right? Oh, yeah, the auto grabber. We'd have 21,000 in the bank if I get 4,000 more, which I don't even need to sell all the beans. I think I'm going to sell some of them. Mm, man, I'm in such a predicament right now. Because we basically double the money when if we turn them with coffee, right? I'm just going to sell enough to get like, I think we need 51,000, right? To get the pigs, 16,000. The red and sprinkler, 10,000. That's going to be 26,000. And then 25,000 for the auto grabber. Yeah, 51,000, I believe, right? Yeah, let's keep selling these. One at a time until we hit 51,000. And then I don't know, I'll, maybe 52,000 or whatever. Just so we have a little bit of money left over for the traveling merchant and, you know, see what she has. Yeah, that, that, that sounds fine. Let's, let's wait until we get to, I'd say, like maybe 600 coffee beans left. All right, guys. Oh, man, 599. Whatever. We're at 53,000 gold in our inventory right now. We have enough money. We So after buying all the stuff I want to buy, because I'm addicted, right? And I assume the sewer guy doesn't close, like, at any time. So we, we can go to him after Marnie. 53,000. So we're going to have about 2,627 gold left over to buy stuff from the traveling merchant. That sounds good to me. I like that. Yeah. And by the way, is there... Yeah, we're not going to find anything here, I don't think, right? Yeah, I think we're fine. Yeah, let's just go, 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 go. Get on the horse, go over to Marnie right now. Right, heck, I know there's a bulletin board uh, thing right there, but we need to go over to Marnie like ASAP. And it's going to be 3.30 whenever I go through. Yeah, 3.30. Yeah, we're going to be able to talk to her. She's not closed on Fridays, I don't think, right? She closes on Monday and Tuesday. I have that written down in my notes. So there she is, and there's Jazz playing with some doll or something like that. I don't know. First animal, yeah, let's, let's buy the, yep, there, there it is right there. 16,000, yep, 16,000. These pigs are trained to find truffles lives in the barn. Okay, so let's buy a pig, find a heckin' Lee, right? And by the way, oh yeah, yeah, we have to talk to Robin to see if we can upgrade the greenhouse. Trabo Chenu Candy. What, what is a good pig name? Shusibi? Sh I don't even know what that name was. Mimo, Tamobo, ne just Neck? Okay, Neck. There you go, just call you Neck because you're a pig and you don't have a neck. So there you go, your neck is in your name. <laughs> I'll send Little Neck to her. I probably should have named her Little Neck instead. Or No Neck. I don't know. She's named Neck, though. Actually, I don't even know. Is it a boy or a girl? I don't know. It doesn't even matter. I don't know. Which, speaking of such, someone left a comment last episode. I was, I was like, oh, we have a male rabbit. We have a female rabbit. Are they going to literally breed like bunnies? Apparently, they don't even breed. So that kind of sucks there. Uh, but anyways, supply shop. Auto grabber for 25000 Are we going to actually do that right now? I think so. Because I'm, I'm curious. It says, it says on the wiki, it will milk the cows. The milk, it will milk the the goats and cheer the sheep as well. Can it pick up the truffles too? Because I don't think it said that on the, well, hold on. It didn't say that on the wiki, did it? I don't remember. Automatically harvest milk from cows and goats and wool from sheep. One place down the bottom. Does it say anything about a pig? Uh, yeah, it doesn't say anything about a pig, so. Uh, oh wait, hold on. There's a thing called an auto petter. What is the auto, how, where do we get that? The auto petter is a tool that automatically pets barn and coop animals every day. I need this. It can be purchased from the Joja Mart for 50,000 gold after completing the Joja Community Develop Form. Development Form. Where do, how do you do that? It could also be found in the Skull Cavern treasure chests. I can need this. So the auto grabber in combination with the auto petter is going to like almost automate the heckin' farms. All I need to do after that is just manually grab the stuff from the auto grabber, put it inside the mayonnaise machine and uh, cheese makers, and then of course grab them back out. Unless there's a way to automate that one as well. That'd be interesting. Huh. Interesting stuff. And by the way, you guys, I'm looking at the recording length right now. Oh, whoops. What happened? I'm looking at the recording length. I'm, I'm at an hour and seven minutes right now, so... Uh, yeah, this is being cut up into two episodes again. <laughs> I really got sucked into the game today again, you guys. Golly. And, uh... It's 3.40. Yeah, it's a little bit too late to end off an episode here and have, like, a random hour-long episode. So, yeah. Uh, let's, let's get the auto grabber. I'm, like, really in the mood or, like, in the game right here. So uh, I, I don't want to I don't want to like back out it right now and forget all the stuff I was working towards. So yeah, let's, let's buy that auto grabber. So we have, now we have an auto grabber in both the barn and the coop, which is amazing. Uh, we can go over here, go talk to the traveling trader person. And we, we have a just ignore that one that's in our bank account right there. Let's act like we only have twenty six hundred gold. Hardwood, pufferfish, parsnips. I don't need that trash. Batwing, coleslaw, coconut, rare, uh, rare seed again. You know what? Boom. 
And now we have basically 1,627. Yeah, we're not going to spend anything else. Green couch. I already have a random wizard couch I don't even use. Yeah, everything else is trash. Okay, so now we have how many? 15 rare seeds? Uh, I still need to play this one inside the greenhouse. I think we can still go over to the uh, sewer guy. Yeah, you know what? I think it might be easier if I go to the sewer guy this way. Ah! I think it might be easier if I go to the sewer guy this way, right? Instead of going all the way down there. Uh, so let's just go this way. It's a little bit easier because I don't have to go through all the trees and the bridges and all the kind of jazz, right? So let's go down to the sewer. Let's go buy a 10,000 gold uh, Iridium Sprinkler. And I'm going to be using that for... I don't even know what I'm going to use that for, honestly. Dot, 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 Krobus. Uh, there it is right there, Iridium Sprinkler. Okay, cool, awesome. And I guess we can craft the fourth one because we have like two or three uh, Iridium bars right now. So I, I, I would not be against just crafting the last one. So, yeah. Is there anything else I want to do right now? So we spent all of our money, basically, yeah. Do I need to do anything else? I don't think so. Yeah, I, I guess we can just go home because we have the auto grabber now. I guess we'll just go home and and, and and maybe just do some, take care of the coffee and all the kind of stuff. Hey, look at that. There's Kent randomly under the, yeah, you know what? Let's talk to him. What are you doing under that tree during the rain? Is there a special reason why? It looks like a decent day for fishing, doesn't it? No, I guess so. You know what? We could go fishing, but I, I don't really want to. If, if it rains during the, what the, man, if it rains during the fall, yeah, yeah, during the fall. Uh, then, yeah, we need to, because that's going to be the last fish for the community center, right? So, yeah, definitely want to do that buff right now. And then, yeah, Pam just out in the rain, just sitting out in the rain, waiting for someone to take over the heckin' desert when no one's going. So, <laughs> I don't know, that's kind of sad, honestly. Like, literally just out in the rain, but no customers. Oh, Yeah, let's just go back to Pam over here. And by the way, yeah, uh, I never got this battery, so let's, let's get that battery so we can get another battery tomorrow whenever the rain stops. Uh, don't want to forget about that. Let's check around the computer, see if I might have missed anything. Uh, crops ready 150. I'm pretty sure that's 99%, if not 100% coffee. No, it's got to be nice because we we're always going to have poppies over there, right? So, yeah. Um, let me go take care of the greenhouse real quick. And then the poppies. Yeah, see, I want to put them up there because at least they'll be separated from the farm and I'm not going to accidentally harvest them like that, right? Uh, oh, yeah, I'm going to need to get another fish for the... Man. I'll still water it, though. I, I, need, I need to put a fertilizer over here, but we're going to have another sprinkler here. Yes. And then that's going to be able to... Let's see. One... Hold on. Get, get this out. One, two... Yeah, so there's there's going to be spots here in the middle, though. Like, right here. Yeah, this, like, center area. Like, basically where this little pool of water is down. That's not going to be covered by the sprinkler, so that kind of sucks. I guess that's not going to be possible until we have that, like, pressure valve or whatever that thing was that you guys said. And by the way, do we have, uh... The, the, the fiber? Is this, is this done down here? Because there's, like... Oh, man, no, it's not. Golly. Okay, well, whatever. Let's grab this over here. We have some oak resin just kind of done. And let me go grab all the uh, coffee beans up there. And I'm, I'm really, I'm, for some reason, I keep thinking there's something I need to do. Oh, yeah. It's a little bit too late now. The Omni Geos. I was going over to Clint's, but uh, he's closed now. So oopsie doopsie, I suppose, right? We got some worms right here. Uh, there you go. Oh, another chicken statue. Hey, uh, how much do I get out of there if I want to sell it? 50 gold. I guess I'll sell it. Like, do, does it say anyone likes that as a gift? Uh, there's 31 dislike it. Okay, yeah, I'm not taking that risk. Two like it, 31 dislike it. Yeah, not doing that, hater. <laughs> but yeah, I guess I'll just sell that as well as go take care of all the, uh, you know, sell that trash. Uh, I'll, I'll grab all the coffee beans and all the kind of stuff, too. And then, yeah, I need to make another quality, quality, quality of fertilizer. So let me grab a random, yeah, grab the mus muscle. And I, I'll grab two sap. I should be able to make that quality fertilizer. Another geode, or, uh, jade is done. I don't think geodes work in the, uh, that mineral thing. I think it's literally only like actual minerals that work in that, right? There you go. Grab that. And uh, forget to put the oak resin up inside of that. Uh, there it is right there. Cool. Oh, yeah. The mini obelisk. Can I make that now? Can I make two of them? I can only make one. I am one solar essence away. Ooh. Can I buy? I think you can. Can't you buy a solar essence from the sewer guy? I kind of want to get the mini obelisks. We have enough gold bar. We have plenty of gold bars like after after crafting this. I kind of want to go to the sewer guy, buy one solar essence, and then get the minute, and then we'll be able to go over to the greenhouse like instantly, boom, right? So there you go, quality fertilizer. Let's get that going. Uh, let, let me go do that real quick. I'm going to get another. Uh, by the way, I sold all my coffee, didn't I? Oh no, I still have some uh, espresso in my inventory. Okay, yeah, get that going. Get on our horse. Let's go down to the uh, sewer dude, and uh, I suppose we'll just go buy a heckin' uh, solar essence. I think, right? Oh, it stinks. Well, I'm like, I ain't in the sewer, right? But anyways, let's go talk to Krobus. Uh, okay, yeah, 80 for each one. He has 10 in stock. Let's do that. That's that's. I'm fine with that price. Uh, I could have bought a star drop. That's what that one is called, star drop. Could have bought that for the 20 grand or whatever, but not that big of a deal. So we have pigs. I, I, oh, yeah, I need to go pet the pig, as well as go place down the other cheese maker I have. 
Uh, oh wait, no, I already did. Uh, Autograver, that's the thing I want to go place down. Uh, and then by the way, I, I, I didn't even check up on the luck and all the kind of stuff today. Uh, it is Friday too, so do I want to do the parsnip thing again? Because I've got I've got plenty of time. Ah, uh, where is everybody? Like, where where are all the people that usually go to the to the saloon? Where are they at on this? Emily can't max her out anymore. Shane. Nah, I'd have to start. Oh yeah, I am already dating him, so I, I guess I guess he can move up a little bit there. Demetrius, I th think sometimes he does go into there. Robin sometimes. Gus, Clint. I'm like, it wouldn't hurt to bring. I'm like, I don't know why I'm over here. Like, oh, should I get more friendship with these people? Like, I'm contemplating. Like, well, should I do that? Even though it's like, it's an obvious always yes, right? <laughs> Anyways, yeah, I guess we could. If if I have a lot of parsnips left over, I, I think I do. Like gold star parsnips, like 13 of them or something like that, right? I think I have enough left over where it, it makes sense to do that. So I, I guess I could check up on that real quick. There it is. Oh, I've got okay, 12. That's fine. I'll probably miss out on like one person though. Let's get those obelisks, because I'm very curious about that. Yep, boom! Look at that, I can get two. So, boom, boom. And if I get this obelisk and put it, like, heck in... Can I put that... Yes, I can put it in here. Okay, cool. You know what? Put that... What? Oh, my... Okay, whatever. Put it out, put it out, put it, like, right here. No! Oh my gosh! Where, where in the world do I put it? Um... Wait, where'd it go? Oh, there it is. I don't know where I want to put it. Uh, get rid of the campfire. What did the horses... Get out of the way, horse! Oh my gosh, get out of the heckin' way! Okay, get, get rid of the campfire that's like right there, and I guess I put the obelisk right, right there. That, 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 that's a fine spot to put it. I'm like freaking out. Just, I'm racing against the clock and all the kind of jazz. There you go. I guess we can put it like from there, and the other side could be over by the greenhouse right here. Like on the outside. Kind of sucks you can't do it on the inside though, but there you go. So if I did this, and then boom. I like that. That that works out pretty well. Wow, it's really dark. I'm going to get some torches or something here, guys. Well, I, I have them up in storage. I need to go grab them. Uh, and I assume, yeah, I don't need a heckin' scarecrow in here unless a heckin' crow breaks in, right? So I guess I'm fine. <laughs> I, I guess I don't need to worry about that. There you go. So all those are uh, fertilized, which is really good. Don't know if I want to get star fruit going today. And by the way, where's that? Oh, yeah, I already placed it down right there. I was about to say, like, where's that last uh, sprinkler? I need to make the last sprinkler, yeah. Uh, I guess I can't. Uh, yeah, I have to dismount from the horse to do that. Man. Okay, whatever. Uh, what am I doing? Nine fifty right now. Uh, I guess we can go over to there real quick and then come back, and then I'll be able to get grab all the coffee and stuff just real quick. God, heckin'. <laughs> yeah, I assume you can't. You can't put. It can only be placed on the farm, so you can't put like one on the farm and then the other one like on the beach and have a tell. Oh, what? How did? How did I dismount? Dismount right there. My keyboard is heckin' up. Uh. But yeah, it seems like it's an inter-farm sort of teleport, so you can't, like, teleport from the farm to somewhere else, unfortunately. Anyways, uh, Harvey, I hardly ever do anything, uh, for you, so there you go. Nice gift, awesome. Anyone else, like, walking home already? I don't think so, I think we're good. Uh, okay, nothing there. Get out of the way, horse! Oh my gosh! Go inside, 10.30. Okay, cool. Willie, um, I feel like he's already high up, isn't he? Where is he on this? Oh yeah, he can get another heart. He's at seven hearts right now. Yeah, you know what? Yeah, boom. Uh, whoops. There you go, boom. This looks great, lad. Thank you. There you go. And uh, Clint, this is a fun gift. Thanks. Shane, he's already pretty high up, so don't want to don't don't want to give him anything. Leah, yeah, definitely Leah. Really nice gift. Pam, I she's she's like second place. Yeah, she's like right there. I could have. All right, you guys are back. Uh, so basically, like a storm is passing by in real life, and the power like surged or like went off for like a second and then came back on. But I have all my computers hooked up to a battery backup to make sure that they still run even if the power goes out for like up to 30 minutes and stuff like that so it's kind of crazy so thankfully i have that so the game is still running in the background but uh, if you guys are wondering if i don't even know if it even got picked up on the microphone if you guys heard it beeping in the background right there but i'm so flustered right now i don't even know what we're doing i think we're talking about pam being like one heart away from being maxed out uh, and i was like oh man should i even give it to her but i guess i guess we can still give it to her because like we have a very limited amount of gold star parsnips here i mean do we have seven left i guess we'll give another one to gus where's he at by the way uh, oh yeah, he's at seven hearts as well. I guess we'll give another one there, but does someone like Emily, we're, like, we're not, she's maxed out basically right now, unless we start, you know, we give her a bouquet or whatever, right? So, doesn't make sense to give her one. I guess we can give one to Shane, just because why not? There you go, this is great, thanks. And then, uh, we still have five left over. I thought there'd be more people here, but I guess not. Unless they went home, because I'm like, they might have gone home. They might have, like, left earlier or whatever, right? So, anyways, yeah, we have this mission here, too. I guess I can look at this. Need octopus for an, I don't think we have octopus. For the, uh, for the wizard, but I guess we'll check our fish chest. I think we have squid. I think we have midnight squid, but I don't think we have octopus. I guess I could check this thing, right? To see if we ever even caught an octopus. Uh, where would an octopus be on it? Is that an octopus? I don't know. It's the only thing that looks like it has tentacles that we haven't sold yet, you know? Oh, wait. Midnight squid. 
Uh, yeah, I guess maybe that's the octopus, like, right there. Uh, but so I guess that means that I haven't caught it yet. And I don't even know where you can. Does it? Hold on. <laughs> does it Does it tell me what that is if I do this and then pull up the mod? Oh, yeah. Hey, look at that. Just reveals it, like, then and there. Okay. A mysterious and intelligent creature. So how do we catch that thing? Uh, time of day, location. Ginger. Okay, oh, okay. It's another ginger island thing. Okay. Huge spoilers there. Uh, apparently we unlocked that thing a little bit later, you guys kept on saying, so, yeah. Kinda sucks that, uh, the mod that I have installed is spoiling me on those things. I have it set up to, you know, not spoil me on certain things. I need to figure out how to make it not spoil me on that sort of thing as well. But it is 11.20 right now, I do need to go over here and go place down the other, uh, cheese mate. Or was it? No, 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 the auto grabber, that's what it was, yeah. So we could actually use that thing in the morning and see how it works, uh, milking the cows and all that kind of stuff in the morning, so. I suppose we could put it, like, say here? There you go, next to the heater. So let's go ahead and take care of, you know, milking the cows and all the kind of stuff. Maybe in the future we can get that auto petter, and then, like, our farm or our ranch area is going to be basically automated. All I have to do now is just pick up all the stuff out of the auto grabber and put it inside the... the what the... I made the horses in the way. <laughs> inside of the, uh... The, what do you call it? The mayonnaise machines and the, uh, cheese machines and all the kind of stuff, right? Mayonnaise maker. So, that's going to be cool, but, uh, for right now, I don't know how much time we have left to, uh, we have about a minute left right there. I'll try and get all the coffee over. And by the way, you guys said, yeah, last week of the month, uh, we need to try and get stuff there. Oh, yeah, and then ancient fruit are done, too. Yeah, I definitely want to get those. Okay, so, yeah, we can get more seeds. Go plant those down. Um, the seed maker. Yeah, let's get a little, 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 little. Coffee's not really that important. I'm going to get the seed maker going right now. And I'll see if I can get uh, one coal. Oh, yeah, let's go grab a coal. Uh, just so we hopefully we can have all of our ancient fruit growing at the same rate, right? So hopefully we can turn all of these into ancient fruit seeds. And hopefully we get more ancient fruit seeds than just one per uh, ancient fruit right there, right? So I'm going to grab those sap. And I'm going to grab a few fish and hopefully get a few quality fertilizer, right? But let's get this going over here. In the, uh, why is it not working? Ancient fruit. Yeah, this is a Oh, wait, no, it's a geode cracker. Hold on. Oh, yeah, yeah, over here. We have the seed make seed machine. I forgot we moved them over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So let's get those going. It's 12.50 right now. Yeah, we don't have any time to get the coffee. Not that big of a deal, though, but, uh, let's go to be done here. Just a bit. Does it tell you? Hold on. Oh, it literally just... Okay, just finish it. Just finish. Grab it. Grab it. Get the horses constantly in the way. We got three ancient seeds right there. Okay, not bad. Uh, okay, yeah, three. I was about to say, is it three on top of the two we already had? But no. Uh, so... Where in the world? What, what am I doing? Oh, yeah. I guess we could use the mussels. So there you go. And the perch. Ghost fish. I kind of want to keep that thing. Bream. Yeah, sure. Why not? Use that. Uh, then we have one more fish, right? Because we need to get three. So, I don't know. A crab. Sure. Why not? Let's turn those into quality fertilizer. There you go. Use the obelisk to go over to the greenhouse real quick. Does that make time pad? No, it doesn't. Oh, nice. Just does it instantly. Cool. And then, uh, just 110 right now. Oh, man. Yeah, see, it's darker now. I can't see a thing. So one, two, three. We need to water and give it the fertilizer. Fertilizer. Fertilizer, fertilizer. And let's water it. 120. Yeah, we have we have time. I don't know why I'm, like, freaking out here, but, uh... There you go. Okay, cool. All those over there have been prepared, which is really awesome. Man, this ancient... Uh, what is what is the obsidian oblet? What that, that thing is called? I don't know what it's called. Um, flustered all over the place. You guys know the deal. Uh, is there anything else I want to take care of right now, by the way? Yeah, stuff we see. I guess we can put that up in storage or something like that. I don't know. Uh, then some other stuff. I guess I'll put that up as well. There we go. Put that up, sap up. There you go. Starfruit seeds. Put that up as well. And then tea leaves. Uh, I don't know where we're putting that. Oh, yeah. We're putting that in the fridge, aren't we? Yeah. And let's put the coal up over here as well as the jade. And I guess put the Omni Geo zip as well because I know I'm <laughs> just going to forget about it anyways, right? Yep. Gold star parsnips. And uh, in the fridge. Put the ingredients up like that. Cool. Awesome. I think we're pretty well set here. Just need to go out and put the coffee beans back and then a campfire. Don't know what to do with that, honestly. But for right now, I think we have a pretty successful day there, you guys. We get the greenhouse back. We a bunch of ancient fruit and rare seeds and all the kind of stuff. We plant all those over there, which is really awesome. Uh, we probably got mayonnaise. I, I, I probably could have got some mayonnaise from the uh, the chicken area, but whatever. We got one uh, random cheese and a chicken statue as well. We got 500 gold overnight. Not bad. Can't complain about that, right? But day 27 of summer has started, and I believe this is the day when we get the the first day that we get the, uh, the melons. So we want to see if there's a giant melon, and then tomorrow on the 28th, uh, there's still a chance for a giant melon to spawn in. So definitely want to keep our eye out for that. Uh, then if we don't get one tomorrow on the 28th, we need to uh, harvest them so we don't lose them, right? Because they're going to, they're going to like, die or reset or whatever on the first of fall. So don't want to forget about that for next episode. But for right now, let's go let's go outside, see if there's anything happening. No mail. No giant melons right now. Man, well, that sucks. At least we have a lot more melon possibilities here this time around. Uh, there's only, like, two spots that got struck by lightning, I assume. So that's kind of that's kind of interesting. We haven't gotten it yet. But like I said, we can still get some more uh, tomorrow on the 28th. Still need to get all the coffee over here. We can do that. No problemo. But I'm curious... If we go over here and check up on that auto grabber, the milk and all the kind of stuff, is that already done? It is? Wow! 
Four large milk, one goat milk, amazing. Just like the chicken coop auto grabber thing. So all we have to do is just grab it, put inside the mayonnaise machine, and then boom, we're done. And then yeah, all the all the all the lightning rods have have lightning or whatever batteries on them again. And yeah, another set of uh, eggs right there as well. Amazing, an amazing setup over here, you guys. This is cool. I kind of want to see how much. Uh, oh yeah, it's this chest right here. We've 164 hay there. I'm going to end off the episode here pretty soon. So I know I know there's time passing and whatnot. But when we come back, by the way, the bunnies are they adults now or? Uh, okay, three days. Okay, fall second. Uh, they're going to, you betcha. <laughs> they're going to turn into adults, and I guess their legs are going to start falling off. We could use those rabbit's foots or whatever, right? So, that's going to be good. Uh, then over here, 100-something, uh, then 100, uh, 185. We have a pretty good amount of hay. Uh, like we said earlier, or last year, actually, we want to start stockpiling hay for, oh yeah, by the way, yeah, we have a pig. I forgot about that. Yeah, neck. <laughs> Is that a baby pig? Uh, neck looks very happy to, okay, nine days. Should have pet her yesterday or whatever. Does it say? Should have pet the pig yesterday. Uh, it doesn't say. Okay, well, I guess it's just a pig, just in general. Uh, but yeah, I should have pet the pig yesterday. I guess I, I, I guess I didn't see it. Did I? Was it there last night when I looked at the, uh, the place down the autograph? Or I didn't see it. I, I definitely would have noticed a giant pink thing, but I guess I didn't see it. <laughs> kind of want to look at my footage now. But anyways, uh, I'm like, it is a pretty big area here. Yeah, look at this. It could have been like over here, and I didn't even realize it. But anyways, I guess I'll end off the episode right here because I accidentally recorded two episodes because I got sucked into the game and uh, just like it happened like 40,000 other times, I recorded a double episode. I'm going to have to split it into two episodes. So <laughs> anyways, oh yeah, I guess if anything, we could also go take a look at our uh, greenhouse, our newly up or not really upgraded, but newly repaired greenhouse. And see uh, if there's any growth progress, I guess you could describe it as. We could actually check that by doing this. Uh, fall 26 is when the ancient fruits are going to be done or fruit uh, are going to be done. And then uh, fall 22. Okay, yeah. Okay, so it takes 24 days for the sweet gem berry, and then 28 days for the ancient fruit, which makes sense because the ancient fruit, you know, constantly, it continues bearing fruit, if you will. So that's interesting there. But the rare seed, yeah, you just, you, you pick it up and then boom, it's, you have to replant it, right? So that kind of sucks there, but it kind of makes sense. Uh, it kind of balances out. It's one week faster, but it doesn't regrow. But at the same time, in the long run, the ancient fruit, yeah, definitely a lot better. And of course, we have this cool little, little obelisk set up, so we can go back and forth between the, uh, Whatever it is over there, a lot easier. I kind of want to move this, maybe make it not so hidden there, you know? I don't know if I can move it. Can I move it, like, up, up there, you know? I don't know. I can put it there, but I can put it here. Boom. Yeah, look at that. Huh. Hold on, I, I need to redo this next episode. Anyways, I got super distracted right there. And then, uh, yeah, a bunch of uh, time passed for a bunch of grass to continue to grow right there, right? I uh, should have got more uh, whatever over here, uh, fiber stuff planted, but whatever, maybe we'll worry about that next episode. Speaking of next episode, I guess we'll end off this episode and start looking forward to next episode. So thank you guys all very much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to let me know by leaving a like down below. And if you guys want more of these awesome videos, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And while you're down there, be sure to ring that bell so YouTube sends you a notification as soon as the next episode of Stardew Valley comes out so you don't miss it because we're at the tail end of summer. Tomorrow in game on the 28th, we do have have a uh well it's not gonna show me i don't have a calendar built into me we have like a midnight jellies event or whatever tomorrow on the 28th as well as we're going to get the melons like another like another day of growth or whatever over there as well as the star fruit is going to be done tomorrow too so don't want to forget about that uh so there's a lot of stuff happening at the end of the month and of course we're going to have to prepare for fall as well so we're, on the 28th we might as well just kill off our crops and just kind of prepare all the land over here for new seeds and all that kind of stuff so we don't have to wait and do that on the first of the month right uh, we can get that done on the last of the month or season whatever anyways uh, already did the outro right there, so thank you guys all very much for watching, and I'll do the outro right next to this pig. <laughs> thank you guys all very much for watching, and I'll see you guys here next time with some more Stardew Valley. Oh, bye there. This grass is going to grow back anyways, don't worry. <laughs> oh, bye there.